On Oihagi Bridge in Ringo, Zoro battles the thief Gyukimaru in order to reclaim Shisui. Zoro tells Gyukimaru that he met Ryuma, but Gyukimaru refuses to believe him since Ryuma died centuries ago. As they spar, Gyukimaru talks about how Wano country was once known as the City of Gold, and Ryuma led the country's samurai in defending it from many threats, causing him and his sword Shisui, as a sword god, to become national treasures. Zoro does not care about that and is intent on regaining Shisui so he can possess all three of his swords again, and Gyukimaru replies that someone like him has no right to a black sword, Kakuto, which Shisui became after many battles. Zoro is intrigued at the mention of the Kakuto, having wondered about it himself, but before he can ask Gyukimaru about it, a woman suddenly cries out for help from behind him. An injured woman heads toward the bridge with Toko pleading for their lives, and Kamazo then leaps toward them to attack. Zoro counters his side, though is attacked again by Gyukimaru, who is intent on continuing their battle despite their situation. The injured woman begs Zoro for help, and since he does not want to see them murdered, he agrees in return for food and alcohol. Zoro and Kamazo then battle, with Zoro remarking that the assassin is strong. Gyukimaru stands waiting on the bridge, and he then attacks Zoro after seeing an opening, forcing him to dodge again. The attack enables Kamazo to pierce Zoro through the shoulder with a scythe. However, he is unable to pull it out, and Zoro takes the scythe and puts it in his mouth to use Santoryu once again, he then charges at Kamazo and strikes him down. 